And for anyone driving in or through Polk County, the county is running low on fuel after damage from Tropical Storm Barrel. Emergency managers are asking the state for help to bring more fuel into that area. KTRE's Shakina Davis reports. In Polk County, lines are growing longer as only a handful of local gas stations have fuel available. These stations include Tobacco Barn in Onalaska, Easy Travel Plaza in Livingston, Shell One Stop by Reservation, and Shell at Beacon Bay. County Judge Sidney Murphy says they've talked with the state and the Texas Department of Emergency Management regarding the scarcity of fuel in Polk County. She says part of this has to do with the county being close to Houston. People from Humble, I mean, Humble is 40 minutes away, 35 if you drive really fast. Um, you know, so they come up here and get fuel or stock up. Polk County resident Claudia Davalos is getting gas for her generator after three days of no electricity and water. It's, it's a struggle, but it's not the first time. We know we can survive. Another resident, Pat Cook, says though she's not struggling to keep gas in her vehicle, people should always remember to gas up before a storm. If you have uh, facilities to store extra fuel, uh, it's wise to do it. Murphy explains what could happen if fuel is not available. If we don't get fuel, if we don't get gasoline or diesel or propane, whatever their generators run on, well then that's going to be more people without air conditioning. Shakina Davis, KTRE, East Texas News 9. Residents are being encouraged to travel to Dyball, Lufkin or Woodville for fuel and supplies.